Hi there, and welcome to the Maths on the Move Active Quiz. My name's Dave from Primary Sports Coaching Limited, and we've got a Maths on the Move quiz for you today with a little bit of a twist. We've got 10 questions, but instead of writing the answers down, we want you to match your answers to the moves that are shown on the screen in front of you. There'll be three possible answers for each question. Are you ready? Let's get started. Okay, question one. What is six multiplied by 12? What is six multiplied by 12? If you think it's answer A, 60. Do you think it's answer B, 72? Or answer C, 84? If you think it's answer A, do star jumps. If you think it's answer B, do jab punches. Or if you think it's answer C, do pendulum legs. And stop there. The correct answer was answer B, 72. So if you've got answer B and you've been doing jab punches, well done, give yourself a point. Question two. 24 sweets are shared between four children. How many sweets did they each receive? Have a little think before the answers come on screen. Do you think it's answer A, eight? Answer B, four, or answer C, six. If you think it's A, do the windmill. I think it's B, do running on the spot. If you think it's answer C, do donkey kicks. And stop there. The correct answer was answer C, six. So if you've got answer C and you were doing donkey kicks, well done, give yourself a point. Question three. What is 369 rounded to the nearest 100? What is 369 rounded to the nearest 100? Do you think it's answer A, 400? Answer B, 300? Or answer C, 370. If you think it's answer A, do star jumps. If you think it's answer B, do burpees. If you think it's answer C, do high knees. And stop there, well done. The correct answer was answer A, 400. So if you've got answer A and you were doing star jumps, well done, give yourself a point. Question four. What is 15 in Roman numerals? What is 15 in Roman numerals? Do you think it's answer A, XV? Answer B, XXI? Or answer C, XI? If you think it's answer A, bounce on the spot. If you think it's answer B, do a balance. If you think it's answer C, do spotty dogs. And stop there, well done. The correct answer is answer A, X, V. So if you've got answer A and you were bouncing on the spot, well done, give yourself a point. Question five. What is 6.2 plus 0 0.7? Have a little think for the answers come on screen. Do you think it's answer A, 13.2? Answer B, 6.9 or answer C, 
8.4. If you think it's A, do a butterfly. Think it's B, do backflicks. Think it's answer C, do a balance. And stop there, well done. The correct answer was answer B, 6.9. So if you got answer B and you were doing backflicks, well done, give yourself a point. Halfway through guys, keep up the hard work, you're doing great. Question six. Joe ran 100 meters in 13.55 seconds. Round his time to the nearest second. Have a little think for the answers come on screen. Do you think it's answer A, 13, answer B, 10, or answer C, 14? If you think it's A, do pendulum legs. If you think it's B, do bend and shoot. Or if you think it's C, do a balance. And stop there, well done. The correct answer was answer C, 14. So if you got answer C and you were doing a balance, well done, give yourself a point. Question seven, which of the following is the equivalent to 15 over 20? Have a little think. Do you think it's answer A, one over four? Answer B, one over two? Or answer C, 3 over 4. If you think it's A, do star jumps. If you think it's B, do jab punches. Or if you think it's C, do pendulum legs. And stop there, well done. The correct answer is answer C, three over four or three quarters. So if you've got answer C and you were doing pendulum legs, well done, give yourself a point. Question eight, write 0 0.4 as a fraction. Have a little think for the answers come on screen. Do you think it's A, four over 10, B, one over three, or C, three over four. If you think it's A, do the windmill. If you think it's B, do running on the spot. Or if you think it's C, do donkey kicks. And stop there. The correct answer was answer A, four over 10. So if you got answer A and you were doing the windmill, well done, give yourself a point. Question nine. A football session begins at 13.30 p.m. and finishes at 14.45 p.m. How long did the football session last? Do you think it's answer A? One hour, answer B, one hour and 30 minutes, or answer C, one hour and 15 minutes. If you think it's A, do star jumps. If you think it's B, do burpees. If you think it's C, do high knees.
And stop there. The correct answer was answer C, one hour and 15 minutes. So if you got answer C and you were doing high knees, well done, give yourself a point. Last question. Question 10. It is 20 minutes to nine in the morning. Which of these is the correct time in digital format? Have a little think for the answers come on screen. Do you think it's A, 8.40 a.m., B, 9.20 a.m., or C, 29 a.m.? If you think it's A, bounce on the spot. Think it's B, do a balance. Or if you think it's C, do spotty dogs. And stop there, well done. The correct answer was answer A, 8.40 a.m. So if you got answer A and you were bouncing on the spot there, congratulations, give yourself a point. Thank you to everyone who joined in today. I hope you all had fun. Keep a record of your score out of 10 and see if you can beat that score next time on the Maths on the Move active quiz. Thanks for joining us, stay safe. The world around us is changing. You're faced with the new challenge of homeschooling your children. For some, this is a worrying prospect, and for those who are expected to work from home, it's a near impossible task. We worry that our children will fall behind, especially in the core subject areas of English and Maths. Adding variety to your daily routine, whilst keeping your children motivated to learn and remembering to stay active, can be really difficult. The Mighty Maths home learning platform has been developed to help you right now. It keeps your children motivated, boosts confidence and improves attainment in the fundamentals of maths through fun and frequent practice. Using the concept of active learning, Mighty Maths combines fun, on-demand videos to keep your children active with short sets of varied maths arithmetic challenges. Written by teachers and used by primary schools nationwide, Mighty Maths has been developed in line with the national curriculum, so you can rest assured that the questions your children are tackling are appropriate for their age. And using it is really straightforward. There's no need for any printing. Simply select your video, work out with Tom, and then tackle the maths questions, all on any device. The answers are waiting to be revealed, meaning your children can evaluate their progress straight away. We want to help as many households as possible during this period, so we've reduced the price from £60 to just £5 until the 22nd of May. This gives you access to a library of workout videos and maths challenges for your child to tackle. And to keep things fresh, content is updated every 20 days. And like you, we want to support our NHS heroes however we can, which is why £1 of every Mighty Maths purchase will be donated to the NHS. To start using Mighty Maths in your daily homeschool routine, sign up today.